Good morning, it is Painting Sunday. Let's see what I've got today for Painting Sunday. I have, let's just run you through the things that I'm doing because this is if I do the format that I think people might be interested in and other people might copy it. I have here a Windsor and, oh, let's see if I can, Windsor and Newton, Series 7, number one brush. I have a Windsor and Newton, Series 7, double zero brush. Weird thing about these is I have two number ones and two double zeros because mum bought me exactly the same brushes that I had before again for Christmas, which was absolutely magnificent. And at the same time, why didn't she get me a zero and a two? I'm not ungrateful. I'd love me to have them because it means when these ones get a bit old and tired, then I can uh, do some new ones. I have got a Citadel dry brush. Do you know the one thing Citadel dry brushes are great for? Dipping it in the pot getting loads out and squishing it in your wet palette. <clears throat> I have got, you can carry on if you want, I've got Emily with me today. She's building a mask for TF Nation's um, cosplay competition. Citadel, um, I'm going to admit a story now while my lovely girlfriend is sat next to me because she gave me a knife a little while ago, the day after I bought one of these because I couldn't find my old knife because the old one didn't take the right ends for my scalpel and then she just went, oh, I've got this. And then I realised that I'd lost a receipt because I'm a twat. I'm totally so catching up... one of them because I need one for cutting out foam. Well, that's my one because it's my one. Well, uh, where's my one? The most important thing is today I have cup of tea which uh, nothing works without a cup of tea uh i've got a uh, wet palette i think i've spoken about the wet palette before so this is lots and lots of uh ki ki kitchen paper kitchen i've used toilet paper but it's thick toilet paper that i use at work for clearing up spills and stuff then this is parchment paper on the top i've run the parchment paper under the tap and made it all damp and now i'm just leaving it on top of the wet uh paper towel underneath because then when I put paint on top of it, it will keep it nice and moist. It doesn't last for ages. It's not the right stuff, but it's all I've got for now and it'll do. I've also got the amazing lamp that mum bought me for Christmas, which has got a daylight bulb in it. And also if I lift up this and turn that like that, it's got a magnifying glass, Woo! which I, I can't see anymore. I've actually got better eyesight than most pilots. It's just that miniature miniatures are miniature and they're difficult to see. Lastly, but not leastly, I've got my Space Marine, which I can't... Are we gonna, there we go, lovely jubbly. Right, so it is um, brother... Brother... Francis McDougal. Brother Francis McDougal. That's not his name. I'll think of it later. I've got a picture. I've put Blood pictures Viper. Um, that's it. So I'm going to make him... We're going to paint him today. He comes with a 40 mil base. I'm going to put some kitty litter and some agrillion earth on the base and maybe a few skulls out of the skull pack. One of the things I'm terrified about is, I don't know how close this will get, but we're about to find out. Look at the face on that bad boy. So I've got to paint the face and then have the top of the face here, a different colour to the chin of the face, because obviously it's the shroud's going to... So we'll see. We will see. Step one, painting Sunday, here we go. I'm just going to upload all of these videos separately and then I'm going to join them all together using Sony Vegas at the end of the day, maybe tomorrow because life is weird and I'm very stressed. So as long as I don't have a heart attack before the end of the day, I will see you soon.